What's good, guys? Welcome back, welcome to the stream. Welcome to GP Gaming, everyone. What's happening? Do let me know in the chat. Say hi in the chat if you're on the stream, guys. Make sure you guys like the video as always. Share it, make sure you guys do follow GP Gaming. Because that's the only way you're going to get notified about all my future streams. So, looks like... Looks like my brother, he's... He's sleepy, you know? He needs some sleep. So... Before we do anything, we should look for a place... For him... To have some sleep. And we'll hit the road in the morning, guys. And this episode, this... This video is going to be a special one. Alright, let's take a 10 hour break and back at you guys. Early morning out here in Provo. So we are in Provo, guys. So, as planned, you all know the plan. We'll be getting into Colorado, the Centennial State, guys. The Centennial State, Colorado. We'll be exploring Colorado as promised. I told you guys yesterday that we'll get into Colorado. So we are in Provo, Utah. We'll look for something that takes us to Price, Utah or Vernal, Utah. And then from Vernal, we'll get into Colorado. So make sure you guys stay with me, all right? Make sure you guys like the video, share it with your friends, and don't forget to follow GP Gaming. Let's, let's look for a load, guys. I'm back, guys, as promised. I told you guys we'll be exploring a new state, and yeah, we are getting into a new state today. The Centennial State. <clears throat> but before that, let's let's look for something. Let's look for some load that takes us into Colorado. All right, let's look for something. So this here it's price, this here it's one. All right, some oversized load. Oh, huge, con huge construction. This one looks special to me. So, all right, let's take this one, guys. This huge construction. We never did this one before, so let's take this one. All right, let's take it. Let's head to Price, Utah, guys. Make sure you guys stay with me, all right? We'll be getting into Colorado today, so make sure you guys stay with me, all right? We'll be getting into a new state. You you all know about my truck. Yeah, if any one of you guys is new to the stream, so this here it's Peterbilt, and it's got Cummins engine, which is 800 horsepower, guys. It's a lot of power, 800 horsepower. All right, not your not your average P, you know. Not your average P. And guys, make sure you guys like the video. Wow, it's beautiful out here in Provo. Early morning out here in Provo, guys. It's 5:40 in the morning. All right, let me show you guys the interior. You all know, as always, I've got my stack of burgers, some water, some soda, and let's hit the road, guys. Let's head to a pickup location. All right. So this one here is going to be an oversized load. So <clears throat> when you are hauling an oversized load, you get some VIP treatment, you know, some special treatment, you know. And I'll show you guys what that special treatment is. You know, we'll be escorted all the way to Price Utah. We'll have a couple of escort vehicles with us, you know, a cop car at the front. We'll follow that cop car and then there will be this this escort vehicle at the back. So that escort vehicle is going to follow us. So we'll be in the middle of two two escort vehicles, guys. 
VIP treatment. Make sure you guys stay with me, all right? So that you guys don't miss this special load. <coughs> finally, guys, finally we are getting into a new state. Finally. Time is here. Oh, no, man. Thanks. Thanks for that, man. Sorry, sorry. My bad, my bad. Red light violation? What for, man? Wow. Wow, I'm going straight. Why I got this red light violation? And it's green. We made it. We made it. We made it. I don't want to crash it, guys. Don't want to crash it. Whoa. Thank God I... Put this handbrake on, you know, otherwise... It would, it would have been a crash. Alright, let's... Let's continue with our trip. 29 miles away from our picket location. What's going on here in this building? Oh, it looks like a, a construction site. What does this say? You made it. Next exit. Salt Lake City. So we're heading towards Salt Lake City. I don't think so. It shouldn't be there. Alright, so it's halfway. It's in Provo, guys. It's in Provo. You can say it's in the middle of Provo and Salt Lake City. This pickup site. It's a huge load, guys. It's going to be a huge load. 19 miles away. We are not allowed to do that. I'm waiting for the red light to turn green, and it is green, guys. So I think so. This. A pickup site, it's a construction site. And here we are, guys. Lena. Lena. And that's the, that's the one. Clock tanks were refilled and all oh, right. Look at that, guys. Look at that. I mean, it's not a construction. I mean, there's this this plant inside inside the frame. What is it? A huge construction. It's not a construction. I mean, it's a frame made out of steel maybe and then in that in this frame there's this some plant maybe i don't know whatever guys uh, let's do our job all right we don't care what it is we'll just do our job our job is to move this massive load to price you though so guys let's head to price so i told you guys see so this hit's called VIP treatment, you know, privileged. Look at that, an escort vehicle parked in the middle of the road, you know, stopping all the traffic just to let us go. Then there's this cop. Look at him, you know, he's waving at us, you know, that we are all good to go. He's there for us. All good to go, guys. Some VIP treatment out here in Provo, Utah. And 
And look at the smoke, guys. The smoke looks so cool. I love this feature. I love this mode. I love this mode, guys. I think so. We should keep on rock in the middle of the road because the load it's it's a wide one. Don't want to scratch it. Train crack. You all can see. Wow, it's green out here in in Provo, Utah. 111 miles, not a long one, but it is not a long one, a big one, you know. Look at this, another cop car. We are getting all this protocol. Wow, it's a massive load. Look at that guys, look at that, all the traffic, you know, all the traffic waiting for us, and it's on the freeway guys, it's not, not a normal road, you know, it's a freeway, and everyone is waiting for us, you know, just to let us go, and once we, we are on our way, they let all the traffic go you know that that's how it works i told you guys you know we escorted all the way to price you to look at that escort vehicle following us and then we've got this cop car at the front we are following this cop car special treatment you know and the only thing you know the only thing about these oversized loads is that the only bad thing about these oversized loads is that you know there's a speed limit see I can't go 40 so 40 is the maximum limit I can ride and I can't even get off the road I can't even park my truck and yeah I can't even overtake this cop car if I do that it's going to be mission failed all right guys and we have to pay some penalty for that for doing that and some more special treatment look at that guys the traffic lights all red but you know who's gonna stop us all good for us you know who's gonna stop say hi in the chat guys if you're on the screen make sure you guys say hi in the chat all right, let me know what's up, what's happening, what's going on. So, Amrit G, like the video. Thanks for the like, man. Thanks for the like. Say hi in the chat. And we're heading all the way. Look at that, guys. It's, it's, it's a red light, you know, but we are driving, you know, we're not... Oh, McDonald's? McDonald's, wow. Would love to eat a Big Mac, you know. I love Big Macs. Canyon Creek. Oh, guys, you can hear the, the Cummins 800 horsepower engine on the truck. Definitely not stopping for no one. Look at that, this... It's... I mean, all the streets, all the roads are blocked, you know? And it's all... all for us. Massive load, guys. A massive load to to price Utah. Oversized load, you all can read. And yeah, look at that, some ingenious maybe. Map button. 
Pro. No, we just came from Pro. We'll be heading straight. But all the way straight to Price Heater. Look at that guy's biggest fans. Air Mills. Probably generating some electricity for the towns, you know. Let's do some cinematics, it's gonna be fun, you know. It's gonna look cool. Oh, look at this load. And look at the small foot, so cool. It's 800 horsepower engine, it's, it's roaring, you know. 60 miles to go, guys. It's going to be a sharp one, a sharp grip. And make sure you guys do like the video. Send some likes my way, you know. to the train track so this is it's, it's I think so a bridge on a bridge let me see if I can show you the look at that in the left side you can see it's a bridge for the train track and then on top of the, that bridge there's this bridge you know for, for all the vehicles so, so a bridge on top of a bridge like the video guys what's that Utah. All right, let's let's merge. Oh, hear the sound, guys! I'm in love with this sound. I'm in love with the sound of this engine. And look at the river, guys! Look, it looks beautiful out here in Utah. What's this? What's this? What's this? Soldier Summit? Alright. And I don't want to crash it, guys. I don't want to crash it. I mean, pulling, uh, guys, pulling a load this big, you know, it feels light with this 800 horsepower engine, you know. I'm not feeling much of a load, you know. And guys, we are getting into Colorado today, the Centennial State. I'll let you guys know, you know why it's called the Centennial State, but once we get into Colorado, then I'll definitely tell you guys why it's called the Centennial State. Oh, I can go this way? Wow, man. Let me see. So, if you go this way, we'll head to one of... All right, all right, all right, all right. So our drop of location is going to be just outside Price, Utah. We are already out of 
price here. What's this here? A red station, I think so. Thirty miles to go. Almost there, guys. Almost there. Oversized load, and that's the that's the exit we are taking. So what is it? What city is it? We are in Price. Let me see. Uh, yeah, it's Price, guys. We are in Price, Utah. Let's head to our drop of location. going right from here hopefully without crashing into anything oh that was a bit too wide you know but all right a bit too wide oh look at all the smoke coming out out of the exhaust like the video guys say hi in the chat let me know what's up So we're going left from here, some uphill. Hopefully, I won't crash into anything. Like the stream, guys. Say hi in the chat. Right out here looks like uh, some industrial area, you know. Looks like an industrial. Oh, some off-roading. Wow, I would love to do that, you know. I love driving on these dirt roads. And then let's get in. Look at that, guys! Looks beautiful. Looks beautiful. Look at that massive load at the back. So going this way. All right. All right. All right. Straight. I think so. <laughs> they are drilling some oil here. Yeah, they are drilling some oil here, guys. Look at that machine I don't know what you call it so if anyone of you guys know what that and that thing you know moving up and down it's called let me know in the chat I don't know what it's called but all I know is it's used to drill some oil from the ground wow what a beautiful sight in the middle of nowhere look at that 
all you're gonna see is open lands on both sides and hopefully I'm gonna get a load so we are going all the way to the back guys hopefully hopefully I don't crash into anything help me guys help me out here do let me know about to crash into anything, stop me. I think so. I'm good. Yeah, I'm good. All right, spread and then left. Oh, this here is a drop of location. That's the so that's the spot we are dropping off this massive load, oversized load. Hope you guys liked it. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button. Alright guys. Oh, look at that. All that media people, you know. Like TV people, cops, some engineers, contractors, you know. Everyone waiting for this massive load. Everyone's waiting for this massive load. I messed it up. Alright. Look at that guys, everyone's look at look at them, you know, taking some photos and people waving at me that I did a great job. Alright, let's get rid of this load guys because we gotta get into Colorado today. And it's going to happen today, you know. I don't wanna be late. Alright, let's look for something that takes us to Wernal. You oh, I don't want to go with these massive loads. Let me see. Uh, price. Yeah, let's look out here in price. Hobbs, New Mexico. No, I want to get to Colorado. Werner, Werner, Werner. Nothing for Werner. Oh, come on. Give us something for Werner. It was something for Vernal, you know, so that we can get into Colorado. And the first city we'll be getting, I mean, the first town, it's Rangely, Colorado. Make sure you guys stay with me, all right? We'll get to see some beautiful sights out in Colorado. So, don't miss, guys. Join me. Make sure you guys join me every single day. And for that, you have to. Follow GP Gaming, all right. So that's the that's the only way you all gonna get notified about all my future streams. And yeah, a backhoe loaded to Wernal, guys. We got one here. Steamboat Springs. Oh no, 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 no. I don't want to jump mm -hmm. into Colorado. You know, we'll go one by one. So let me see if anything else for Wernal. Sixty thousand dollars. That's a lot of money, you know. But no, I don't want to drive back into Arizona. Seven thousand for backhoe, and eight thousand for frack tank. Oh, let's take this one, guys. Let's head to Vernal, and then from Vernal we'll get into Colorado, guys. Finally, getting into a new state, the Centennial State. All right, let's begin delivery. Like the stream, guys. Like the screen. Say hi in the chat, guys. I mean, you. I'm 
I'm not seeing anyone in the chat. Let me know what's up with you guys. And here we are guys, this here is a load. And guys, this this vernal, I don't know what it is, uh, it looks like it's down, you know, a small town out here in Utah. Uh, it's at the border of Colorado and Utah. And so this town, we've never been to this town, alright? It's, it's, it's first time I'm going to this town. And hopefully it's gonna be fun, you know. It's gonna be a beautiful little cute town and hopefully I'm gonna have fun and I'm, I'm hopeful you guys are going to have fun too so make sure you guys stay with me alright let me show you this, this small town out here in the Utah I mean at the border of Utah and Colorado frack tank and let's hit the road guys let's hit the road wow this one feels so light so light because we because our, our last load it was an oversized load it was a heavy load a massive load so this one doesn't feel much all right right from here some off-roading let me do some cinematics it's gonna be fun and look at that look at that hopefully I don't crash into anything and I don't want to crash into anything Wow, a site in the middle of nowhere out here in Utah. And we're on the road guys, back on the road. You guys don't forget to like the video. Fatix man. I'll be quick guys, I'll be quick. With this one, 130 miles to go. Good to go, guys. All good to go. I mean, guys, it's good to have all this power on you, on your truck, you know. Got this Cummins 800 horsepower engine, and it feels so good to drive <coughs> my truck with these heavy loads. To the freeway, guys. Provost on the <laughs> heading towards Vernal, Utah. So, this town we've never been to this town, it's going to be our first time. Yeah, it's going to be our first time <clears throat> driving to this town, driving into this town, you know, and exploring this town. So, make sure you guys stay with me. Look at that green fix bus. All of this bus looks so beautiful. And, 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 and I don't want to crash. Let's go this way. And down from here, guys. Down from here. If 
finally got a chance to drive right next to this river the one we were working on <coughs> during our last job so what is this man a crane yard maybe yeah it is a crane yard I think so look at that Wow, man, I wish I could go up this way. Wow, it's gonna be so fun, you know, to drive up from here. And guys, that's that's the thing, you know, that's the that's the only thing I don't like about these about this game, you know. But I'm back in Rock Simulator that you can't drive. I mean, you have to stay on your on your track, you know, on your road. There are lots of lots of paths, lots of lots of dirt roads on the right and on the left, but we we can't go on these roads. So if they open all these roads and you know dirt roads and paths, it would be more fun. It would be more fun. this on the right guys see that's that's what I'm talking about guys I'm sure you all can see these yellow crosses that means we are not allowed to drive on to this this road oh a symmetry a symmetry what is this oh, I don't know how you pronounce it this Yes. Do chest do chest city symmetry. Look at that. Symmetry. Anyway, let's let's get back on the road. Let's get back on the road. Let's get back to work. Seventy miles to go guys, seventy miles away from a drop of site in this small town called Vernal out here in Utah at the border of Utah and Colorado. that little signboard because <clears throat> I told you guys you know we we, we are not only just we, like we don't just drive around you know move all these cargo move all these loads you know but along with moving all these loads and doing all these jobs we to explore you know we do explore different cities different places so I don't want to miss any signboard center street out here in Vernal I think so we are in Vernal already we are almost there guys you can say we are in Vernal you can say we are in Vernal Utah center street some local marketplace Oh, a Nike store. Look at that, guys. Nike clearance store. All right, all right, all right. It's good out here in Vernal. What's this? Thrift Face Supermarket, a pharmacy. All you need, you know, to live in a town, you know, all these important stores and all these things that you need every single day. What's this? 
historical marker historical marker okay, whatever some flags on the left wow it's a beautiful little town guys look at all these beautiful houses lucky people living here city office and welcome center all right all right welcome center are here in Bono. what's that man what's that on the blue board house of dragon all right, all right, all right. what's going on here let me see this sign board look at that little walkway guys little bridge you know I think so for the people to strawberry river guys strawberry river look at that look at that guys strawberry river I mean but I don't see any strawberries in that river do you guys see any strawberries why well, it's called strawberry river whatever let's let's head straight let's head straight semester on this 50 miles to go heading towards Vernal, Utah so guys finally we are getting into we'll be getting into Colorado and it's gonna happen soon and it's gonna happen today it's gonna happen now what's going on here what's this man on the left all these circles oh man I want to arrive on this 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 dirt track on the left let me try, let me try, you know, maybe we can go on this track. Let's give it a go. Maybe, maybe we can go. Oh, we can go. No, we can. Not that lucky, you know. That we get to drive on these dirt roads. And... That should be good enough. Thirty miles to go, guys. Make sure you guys like the stream. Like it, like it, like it. All right. Okay. Hold on a second, guys. I just wanna send this little text message to someone. Let me park here on the side. I mean, we've got no choice but to park. Oh, look at that, man. What a beautiful place. I wish I could get out of my truck and sit there for some time and relax and have some good time, you know. You know, chill for, for a little bit. Look at that. What a beautiful place. A small river. A few little waterfalls, I think so. Well, hold on a second, guys. Let me send this little text message.
All right, guys, back at you guys. Look at that, man. I wish I could get out of my truck and sit there for some time. Wow, what a peaceful place down there. Look at all that water. Wow, man. I wish. I wish I could go sit there. Whatever. Let's let's continue with our job. And beautiful out here in Utah. Out here at the border of Utah and Colorado, because I'm gonna say, you know, we are almost at the border. Because this little town called Vernal, it is at the border of Utah and Colorado, but it is in Utah, but it, you can say it's at the border of Utah and Colorado. Because the border is right next to Vernal, you know. Oh, what's this truck doing here, man? Can I buy this truck? Looks like. And. An old school Kenwood. Wow, man, people here, they're so lucky. They've got these beautiful houses, beautiful little quiet town. All right, Vernal, Vernal Pelican Lake. Are we allowed to go right? Let me see how far is this lake. Let's go this way, guys. I think so. This here it's a viewpoint. We'll do some sightseeing here. And then we'll go all the way straight left from here and get back on our back on our track, you know. Let's go right from here, guys. Let's I told you guys, you know, uh, we're not all about job and all about, you know, hauling stuff and moving cargo and all that. But we do explore places, you know, while while doing all these trips, you know, while hauling all these cargoes and stuff, you know, we do explore different places, you know. Are we allowed to go straight? I mean, we should be allowed to go straight. Let's get, what do you say, guys, we should get on this dirt road. I think so we should get on this road road go all the way straight and then, all right all right let's go left guys let's go left and then right from here And left from here. All right, all right, all right. I think so. It's Vernal discovered. Yeah, we are in Vernal, guys. This place, it's Vernal. You've discovered new viewpoint. Oh, I would love to. I love to do some sightseeing you know and I'm sure you all would love to do that too you know so let's let's head to this viewpoint do some sightseeing out here at the border of Utah and Colorado p.m. guys we have to be quick so that we get to our drop location before it gets dark well, let's turn off the engine let's do some sightseeing wild fields of Utah wild fields of Utah here in Vernal Utah at the border of Utah and Colorado a peaceful evening out here in Vernal, Utah. A bit cloudy.
Açım kasır kan. So HM Kasser Khan said hi. Nice. Thanks man. Thanks for your comment. Thanks for your like. And thanks for your support man. Thanks for joining me. Alright let's get back to work. We'll go all the way straight and then go left and get back on a track. Back on the road, guys. Back on the road. The sun is all ready to set. And it's, it's a bit cloudy. Look at that, guys. It's cloudy. I think so it's raining out in Colorado. Alright, what's this? What's this? Pelican Lake. Pelican Lake. Pelican Lake. Recreation area, U.S. Department of Interior Bureau of Land Management. So, Pelican Lake is it on the left. Are we allowed to go to this lake? Let's let's see. You know if we can drive onto this track. You know. Oh, new passage map up there. All right, all right, all right. Please minimize dust. I can't help. Look at that, guys. Pelican Lake. I told you guys, you know, we are not all about moving stuff and, you know, hauling stuff, hauling different cargoes. But we do explore different places like we're doing right now. Look at this beautiful lake, guys. Beautiful lake out here. Pelican Lake. Let me take a quick little, quick little screenshot. What's wrong? All right, let's let's head straight, guys. It's getting dark. I think so. We should be quick and get to a drop location. Wow, it's a beautiful lake, guys. It's a beautiful lake. Pelican Lake. So now, if anyone asks you guys that if you guys have been to Pelican Lake, do let them know. You know. We've Definitely been to Pelican Lake. Map from here, 22 miles to go.
All right, guys, we are in world. I mean, it's a big town, you know. I thought it's going to be a, a cute little town, Burger King. I thought it's going to be a cute little town, you know. But no, man, it's a big town. It's a big, massive town. Oh, look at this! Wow, man. I don't want to say any bad words on my stream, but this guy here definitely deserves some bad words. Man, how dumb he is. Crashed into my truck. Alright guys, Vernal. Finally in Vernal. Wow, it's, it's a massive town. Not a small town. Let's do some overtaking. And what's this dino name here? Dinosaur? Drop off this load. And time to back it up guys. Best best part of the game. I love backing up this trailer. I love backing up. Oh. Oh, no, a bit of damage to the truck. But it happens. Time to show you my parking skills and I hope so I won't let you down. Oh, is it good enough? Yeah, it's good enough. Alright guys, so for some reasons for some reasons, you know. I'll be ending the stream here. We are almost there, guys. I know I did promise that we'll be getting into Colorado, but not today, all right? Because I've got something very important to do. I have to leave, so I'll be ending the stream here. Hope you guys liked it. Make sure you guys join me tomorrow, all right? Because tomorrow we'll be getting into Colorado. You all can see here. You all can see. This is the border. And this strangely is the first town that we'll be exploring in Colorado. So make sure you guys don't miss it. Make sure you guys join me tomorrow on this beautiful trip. And make sure you guys like the video, share it. And don't forget to follow GP Gaming so that you guys don't miss any of my future streams. And I'll see you guys tomorrow.